Hello friends. Today I will discuss about how to create sections in a MATLAB program. So far I have written uh, all the programs in a single section or in a single file. Now I will tell you what is the use of creating multiple sections in a MATLAB program. So let's see. So I have uh, written one program already here. Basically this program is about the amplitude modulation. So you can see here there is no section concept. So when you run this program, the complete program run in one time. Okay. Now I want to uh, create the sections in this program. So I want to just uh, divide this program in two sections. Okay. So first section I want to insert here. So for that uh, you can just uh, click on this button. So once you click here, it create the section. You can uh, write the section name here. Suppose uh, the section one. Okay or whatever the comment you want to write here you can write that comment also okay so one way is that uh, you just uh, click here and uh, create the section and uh, other way is that uh, I want to separate from this plot section okay so by just putting two percentage marks you can create the section so this is the section 2 okay so now this program is divided in two sections by the way this uh, is not mandatory but if you want to put uh, the section name, in that case you have to create here a section. So now your program is divided into two sections. Okay. So first I clear the workspace. Okay. Uh, so now if you want to run section one, then uh, this button is not useful. In that case you have to use this run section. Okay. So for uh, running a particular section, you have to use this button. If you want to run this program uh, completely in one time, then you have to use this key. Right. So at this time section 1 is selected. So run section. So first section is done and uh, no plot is done. Okay. Because plot section is in section 2. So if you click on section 2 and run section then plot is appear. Okay. So now I have divided this program in two sections. Okay. So this program is uh, run in two parts we can say. So now you can think what is the use of this when we can run the whole program in uh, one click then uh, why should I click two times okay so it has multiple advantages of this concept uh, first is that uh, the debugging of uh, a long program become easy uh, if you divide a program in the multiple sections you can run section wise and uh, check whether a particular section is working properly or not so it makes the debugging easy other advantage is that uh, by dividing the program in sections the understanding of the program becomes easy right it makes the program more understandable and uh, the most important advantage of this concept is that uh, suppose uh, uh, you are writing some program that is related to the machine learning like and uh, there are some training phases available so suppose I have written the code uh, for the training in section 1 and I want to just train the system only once and after that I want to just uh, test the system so why should I train the system again and again uh, if I write the training portion in one section and testing code in other section so I will train the system only once and after that I will run the section 2 again and again so that will give me the uh, what results are required and uh, you again may think that uh, what's the problem if, if I run in one time actually uh, the training process takes a lot of time uh, once I was working for a South Korean student so at that time uh, the training section was taking half an hour so you can uh, think suppose I want to check the results uh, four or five times or I want to take uh, results uh, 50 times suppose so how much time I can save or how much time I can waste if I run the whole code every time so uh, whenever you will do research work definitely you will uh, feel the requirement of this uh, section concept and uh, one thing is also worth mentioning here uh, this section concept is available after 2013 versions so in the old version this uh, concept is not available so if you're working in any old version uh, it may not work uh, but the current uh, versions it is available there's no problem so I hope you have enjoyed this lecture so please uh, like this and share with your friends Thank you.